In today's video, I'm going to be going over a new software called Wishpond. Now, if you are new to Wishpond, it is pretty much a lead generation, email marketing, sort of all in one place, all in one platform, where you can keep everything all in house in one spot. And I particularly like this because uh, every other platform that offers an all in one, which is a, you know, a landing page software and email marketing, uh, platform and email automation put together is usually about a hundred dollars to three hundred dollars a month it's expensive right but wishpond has been able to do it for significantly cheaper and they've done a pretty good job i'm not gonna lie now they are relatively new i think they had a bonus or a launch offer not too long ago and i know they got a flood of members so support has been a little bit iffy uh, at the beginning but it's got gotten a whole lot better right so i had a few tickets that I needed um, answers for and it took them a couple of days but the latest ones I've been talking about have been instant so it hasn't been too bad um, but all in all they are really good now I have been using Wishpond for email marketing and land uh, lead generation and this is through Instagram traffic I'll actually show you the campaign in a second uh, show you how I've built it show you the statistics so you can understand how it works and yeah, I'm just going to give you sort of my initial thoughts, what I think could be done better and if I think it's suitable for anyone. So I'm going to jump behind the screen. I'm going to show you the website first just to recap the features and the integrations and then I'll show you my campaigns and you can decide for yourself if it's suitable for you. Okay, so here we are. This is the website of Wishpond. Now, uh, one thing you will notice when I'm shooting this video, they don't even have a pricing tab, nor do they have a get started button. Um, I think this is because of the flood of people that have actually um, gone into Wishpond from that launch offer that they had. But no doubt in a little while, it will um, start back up. So what you'll notice, um, it's actually backed by a few big companies. So Walmart and Lululemon. Uh, they both use it, ESPN as well, which is really cool. But the first thing I want to show you is the um, features that you can expect to have with Wishpond. Now, me personally, I just use it for landing pages, email marketing, and marketing automation, right? So this just means, you know, I've created a landing page where people can go to. I've actually uh, added an A record on my domain, which means uh, the landing page is my domain. And it's after someone visits the page, they can put in their email and I'm offering a free ebook and automatically they will be sent an ebook that I've created. Um, plus they'll be redirected to a page uh, where I am doing affiliate marketing, which is really cool. And then for the next, I think 20 days, every second day they get sent an email. So uh, right there, this is amazing in my eyes because I can put all of this in one place instead of having to have multiple softwares connect together and make this automation happen. Now, a few extra things that you might use it for, online forms, which is really cool, right? You can put forms in there, it's gonna gather all your data. Website pop-ups, if you've got a blog or something, um, you can put a pop-up on your website, which is gonna directly take them to here, and then you can send out automatic emails. You can also do viral promotions that can be um, monitored and tracked in here i haven't done it yet though so i'm not going to go into that too much as well as like referral campaigns lead management call tracking marketing executive i don't really know too much about those um but they're all there and of course cart abandonment which is really cool now if you scroll down you'll probably notice there's still no pricing page on here um, luckily they have kept it alive i actually just typed it in manually and this is what it is so these prices may change i'm not too sure but right now uh, to start off is 50 bucks a month and that's going to give you up to a thousand leads which is perfect for someone starting out you don't really need that much uh, you can have unlimited unlimited landing pages unlimited social contests pop-ups uh, plus you can have email drip campaigns marketing automation and all this other good stuff right so it's actually really really good uh, for 50 bucks you're getting a lot if you know what i mean compared to you know other softwares there are a lot more of course there's a more expensive plan 100 dollars a month and you can choose your own pricing later um, but we're not going to worry about that right now and just once again all all of these plans come with a 14 day trial um, you will have to book a demo just to let you know what will happen if you click on that it's going to take you to a calendar 
where you can have a 30 minute VIP demo. And what this pretty much means is they're gonna walk you through um, what your business is, what your goals are, and then how you can use Wishpond to get you there. It's actually really good talking to someone from the company, um, telling them what your intentions are, and then they can tell you what the company can do for you. So very, very cool, very impressed. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm actually gonna log in, and I'm gonna show you the back office, I'm going to show you some of the templates and I'm going to show you the campaigns that I'm currently running. All right. So this is the back office right here. It's um, very similar to a few other platforms. The back office feel like uh, Landingi. Um, if you haven't seen it, I'll leave a link around for that. It's also another good alternative, but it doesn't have emails. But first of all, I'm going to show you the templates. So um, if you wanted to create a new campaign, there's all these pre-made templates you can use, education campaigns, you know, you've got programs, um, book consultants, pop-ups, you know, photo contests, all this good stuff. Uh, plus you've got general lead capture campaigns. And you'll probably notice like majority of lead capture or landing page softwares have similar templates. So if you've got something in mind, I'm sure it's here. You'll notice also there's generate email campaigns here as well. So you can create uh, sort of already done email marketing templates like sort of automations and you can just go in there and fill them out very cool and there's some contest ones and you know there's loads in here loads to go through um i won't go through that just yet first i want to show you something i think is really cool um i was quickly delete this because i was playing around with it before um so this allows you to create folders which which i really like i know a lot of landing page softwares out there don't have it um, but what it can do is because you have so many different moving parts you can actually create folders um, for each campaign so let's just say i was creating a new uh, campaign for a client or potentially um, if you're running multiple instagram accounts multiple brands you could create one for a brand so i'm going to call this just the instagram brand <clears throat> Instagram yeah Instagram brand will do I'm gonna press save and then once I've done that I can actually go in the folder and I can put all the bits inside here that make it you know whole I can put a landing page in here I can put the marketing automation in here I can put other pages in here um, it's really really cool and each time you make it they'll get put into this folder um, so once you go back if you're managing more than one brand you know things don't get crossed it's really really cool but what I'm actually going to do is I'm going to show you this particular brand here, Paleo Potential. It is just a sort of testing brand, right? So this is the Instagram account I'm using, Paleo Potential. And if I scroll down here, you'll notice there are four particular things, right? So the first one is the email sequence for Paleo Potential, and it says email automation, which is cool. Uh, Paleo Potential, which is the landing page terms of service which is a landing page and privacy policy which is a landing page so what i've done is i've created an actual mini website um, inside this platform and it's just one of the brands that i'm using so that's that's really cool if you think about it so um, the reason i did this is so if someone wanted to click on terms and conditions because as you know if you are marketing on um, if you're doing any type of paid marketing you need to have you know terms and conditions privacy policy that sort of thing so you can build all these pages inside. Now I know a few other platforms don't have this functionality, um, but this one does. Now, what I mentioned earlier as well, is you can see all of your statistics in one dashboard. That to me is so powerful um, because what you can see here is for my main landing page. Um, I've had 257 views, 69 conversions, um, and the conversion rate is 26.85%, which is massive. But you'll, you'll notice I've only got 39 leads. Um, some of the time, people put in a fake email first, as you've seen, um, and then they, they don't get the information they requested, so they put in another one. All in all, it's a really, really good conversion rate, um, and I'm still getting a lot of leads from it. I think this is the last 30 days, I'm not too sure, but it also lets you know how long ago someone's actually been on that page. So an hour ago, someone was on this page, and three minutes ago, someone either clicked an email, got sent an email, or something like that. <clears throat> so first of all, what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you what the page looks like live. And um, so as you can see, the domain is paleopotential.com. And it's really, really basic, right? It's just saying, hey, do you want to get a free cookbook? And if you scroll to the bottom, you'll see I've got the privacy policy here, terms and conditions here as well, terms of service, sorry. So if someone puts in the email here, they're going to get sent an email from me. 
and it's going to have um, the, the cookbook that they're requesting, right? I've created one in Google Docs, I think it was, or Canva or something, and I just sent it out to them. So it's really cool. And what happens is they get redirected to an affiliate offer. If they purchase, I get a commission. It's very cool. Um, but it's a really, really fast way how you can action these types of things, right? Um, I'll quickly show you the editor as well, just so you can um, sort of see what you can expect uh, when you are using it. I know a lot of people get iffy about builders, me being one of them. Um, so they have here the different views you can have, you know, desktop, uh, tablet or mobile, of course. Um, mobile is the one that gets used the most if it's Instagram. That's why I pretty much made everything look good on here. But that's there. Um, also live chats there if you want it, but you can design your campaigns here. This is where you can do the favicons, you know, the backgrounds, um, that sort of thing. Custom CSS, JavaScript. A lot of people won't use much of it, maybe just the background or the section or the favicon. But here you have all your different uh, modules. So you can just drag them into wherever you want it to go. As you can see, the yellow line is where it, where it lands. Um, and inside here, you've got things like more margin, CSS, all that sort of stuff. So I'm just going to delete that. <clears throat> what would else you like to see? Uh, edit the text. If I click on, oh, I just missed with it. Oh, sorry, this one. If I click edit text, text here's all of your things. So it's just a basic landing builder. You know, that's all you really need. Um, what else would you like in here? Leaderboards. So this is for like social giveaways or that sort of thing. Bonuses, promotions, timers. You know, it's got all of the necessary things you need for it to work and also uh, like most page builders have they also have a thank you page where people will go afterwards so you can put all your tracking codes and everything in here your SEO settings are in here as well um, so it's all here right you can publish to all these different places Facebook page embed code I use custom domain as you can see here so pretty much this is a basic builder right you can do a B split testing and everything like that um, it's all really cool it's all really sort of basic in the sense that it does everything you can download as templates save templates editor settings you can show bits and pieces so it's got all the functionality that you need right um it, it truly does and i don't really know what else you'd expect this is what i was looking for click action uh so it's going to submit the form and then redirect people to this page so this bypasses the thank you page um, so that's pretty much the page builder. I don't know what else you would need to know in here. Um, everything's just drag and drop and then you can just type as it is. So I'm going to leave this page. And I'm going to show you the second part of this, which is the email automation. Um, which is really cool. It's also got a little graph here, as you can see, from the landing page. So that's additional stats, conversions, conversion rate. Very cool. So I'm going to go back to my campaign. It's also got a leads tab if you want to see what leads came from where. Uh, and I'll show you the email sequence, show you what that looks like, um, which was a little bit confusing at the beginning, um, but then I understood it. So when it comes out, it'll be blank. So you just say um, what landing page you want it to convert on, what campaign. Um, and then here it has all my emails, right? So there's my email. I can view and edit it in here. So there's the setup, here's the, here's the body. So I've got a basic sort of basic just email here, or you can have cool looking email templates. I'm not going to get into in depth with that, but it's um, straightforward. And then once you do that, you can have like delays. Uh, what else can you add? You can, you can have all these sort of things. You can export leads, trigger a, a webhook, um, you know, award bonuses. I usually just have basic things like um, you know delays so every couple of days they get sent to email so it's very basic but that's pretty much it as you can see I've got nine emails with one day in between so it'll be an 18 day campaign um, which is really cool and also after you've done that once it's been running for a little while uh, you've got the leads column which can show you how your campaigns are doing which campaigns have got as much uh, here's some actions this will be blurred out because it's got people's data but if i click on lists 
it'll show you uh, all my different campaigns which ones are getting leads which ones getting the most activity as you can see I'm only really running this particular one right now but that's pretty much it it's cool you can um export all of your leads as well if you want that's all there one thing I will add is I don't know if you can actually send out an email newsletter blast now that means like if you wanted to send out an email to everyone um, I don't believe you can do it on here I might be wrong if you are using the software and you do know how to do that please let me know in the comments but as far as I'm aware you have to create a create a email campaign and then from that you can send the people to it so it can't just be a blast to everyone but that's pretty much the wish pond um, platform that's why I like it you keep everything in one place um, and it makes it so simple to use so I'm going to jump back to the camera a few closing notes and then we'll call it a day so that's wish pond guys uh, sorry if I blabbed on a little bit too much there there is a lot of power inside of that automation tool um, so that's really cool once again the one thing I do like about it is you can see all of your statistics in one spot you can manage everything in one platform so you don't have to worry about um, you know having different softwares talking to each other and if something's not working something breaks you know stuff's everywhere um, inside here everything is in one house so you can make sure everything works uh, from one place very cool apart from that uh, that's wish pond if you want to try it out there is a link below this video um, you can get started just there and that's pretty much it guys hope you've enjoyed this review smash that like button and subscribe if you want to see more videos and i'll see you on the next one bye